everybody, it's uh, Joe here uh, from Daily Linux Ireland. We live stream every week, uh, do blog postings and video tutorials like this. Today we're going to be discussing how to update records in a database table with SQL. So previously on the screen, if you watched our last one, uh, went through how to insert data into a database table. But you may be faced with the scenario where you actually have the data in and now you say, okay, some of it looks wrong or we needed to correct some. How do we go about doing that? So that's what we're going to do today. Here we are have a table. So it's called a uh, customer. Okay. And it's two columns, uh, customer number, I was a primary key and customer type, which is varchar value length 10. Um, so as I discussed in the last video, uh, anything with a primary key can't be null. So the first scenario we're going to go through is I want to take a go into the update to use the update statement from SQL and tell it to go to DBO customer table and then find a customer go to customer type column um, put it equal to postal where the customer number is 125872 so here we have a scenario at the moment of 125872 in customer number and it has customer type web. So we're gonna change that to, with this logic, is change that to postal. So I'm gonna run that now. Okay. And we should see there now, previously, 125872 was web. Now 125872 is postal. So that's how you would, in this scenario, go and change one record uh, a particular column value to another value with the update uh, syntax in SQL. So let's move to the next scenario. So let's update multiple records at once. So we have the scenario here where we basically have two customer numbers we want to update. So if we go back here, if we look at all the threes in four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, um, these two are both set in customer type to web. But what we're actually going to be doing with this query is we're going to change both of them to mobile okay so obviously you could add in if you've got a big database you could add in lots and lots more there but this scenario we're just going to do these two okay so i'm going to run this code now and uh, click execute here all right and when we run that these two values all the threes and four five six seven eight nine are now a value of mobile when we go back here they're actually have a value of web okay so that's how we would um, update multiple records uh, and column column values for a particular record or records at once and uh, we've done it for two customers here as i said you could do it for more than two so let's go to the next uh, uh, sql syntax for updating uh, records in a database table um okay so this is basically, and that's wrong, I just wanted to show you, let's remove that. What I wanted to show you is if you try to update something where it didn't have a value in the database. So here we are, uh, we're trying to do the update statement again, and we're trying to say is set the customer number equal to two, uh, so this value equal to two, and the customer type equal to error. Now, that's all on the basis that this value here exists okay now this value does we know at the start if we just go back here that value doesn't exist anywhere on the database so i'm expecting this now to fail so let's just run this code and see what happens yeah and we haven't been given any error but no update has happened because the value customer number um doesn't uh, exist so there's nothing because it doesn't exist it does nothing to update on the database table so our final um, um, final uh, piece of SQL syntax for the updates here is where we're going to update two column values of a customer record okay so we have the scenario here we have all the threes so we have it's three 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 all the threes and it's web but what we're looking to do is change all the threes to a three and take the customer type uh, from web to error um, and that's basically what it's doing is set all set customer number to three customer type with error where the customer number equals all those threes so that's six threes so let's run that quickly here now okay so as you can see now um, we've had a refresh of the database table 
that customer which had all these values here is gone it's been replaced by three and then the customer type uh, has been replaced with the value error so that's how you would go and basically apply updates particular columns for particular customer values if you like this video please hit the like and subscribe uh, we don't just do SQL do stuff on Python we're doing stuff on some tools for data analysts which are free soon also doing um, some video tutorials and live streams on um, Tableau for data visualization so if you like that keep an eye out once you subscribe and hit the alert button you should get to know when they're happening appreciate you coming along and we'll catch you soon take care bye